everyone, it's Dr. Jeff here uh, again today. Today we're actually going to talk about everybody's favorite topics after Christmas, and that's diet and, and exercise. Uh, a popular way of, of eating is called uh, the zone. Uh, it's actually the way a lot of NBA and, and uh, NCAA athletes, professional athletes, uh, like to use. Uh, it's divided into three parts. One is carbohydrate, one is protein, and one is, is fat. So what you really want to do is, is, is you want to figure out how much carbohydrate you need. Right? And one way of doing this is you have to calculate your lean muscle mass. Right? Stepping on a scale is not the best way to tell if you're living a healthy lifestyle. You want to know what your, your, your fat percentage is and what your lean muscle mass is. There's other ways to do this. Uh, in the zone, you can go online and for guys it's quite easy. You kind of take your wrist measurement, you take your waist measurement, you figure out the difference. You go into the chart and you can figure out uh, how many, you know, what your fat percentage is and, and what your lean muscle mass is. Once you know what your lean muscle mass is, you have to feed that with carbohydrate. Carbohydrates is kind of the gas that makes it work. Carbohydrates are all your, your sugary types of things, your, your, your juices, your, your uh, vegetables, uh, fruits, that type of thing, pasta, breads, that's your, that's your carbohydrate. Once you can figure out what, your, what your, your carbohydrate needs are, depending on your activity level, then you have to balance that with protein. Now protein is actually very important in your body because that's what repairs your tissues. A lot of your hormones are made out of protein, so when you're short of protein, uh, you can have some hormonal issues. But protein is very important repair, uh, reparative processes. The third part of the equation is, is, uh, is fats. All right? Why is fat important? Well, fat does not produce fat in your body. All right? Fat is actually there to slow down the digestion of carbohydrate. Carbohydrate is mostly sugars. And what you want to do is you want to slow down the breakdown of these sugars because you get too much sugar in your system at one time, you get a glucose spike. And that's what happens when you... You have a, a big lunch in the afternoon, you want to have a nap. You have this big sugar high and then you have the sugar low. So fat actually is, is designed to actually slow down the digestion of that, of that carbohydrate. Right. Good types of fats, uh, olive oil, olives, uh, almonds, good types of fats. Uh, a lot of people now are cooking with coconut oil, uh, another good source of fat. If you want to talk about proteins, protein is your, uh, your meats and your dairy, uh, quinoa, uh, is a good source of protein, soy, things like this are, are your proteins. So ideally if you want to actually uh, get a better lifestyle, what you want to do is you want to figure out what your fat percentage is. And you want to get that down to, ideally for males, down to 16%, for males to 20, females to 22%. Now, so instead of stepping on the scale every week, what you want to do is you want to measure your fat percentage every week and see how you're doing. If you are getting closer to your your ideal fat percentage, you are going to lose weight and your lean muscle mass is going to increase, which means you're going to be a healthier lifestyle. So I'm Dr. Jeff. Thanks for listening. If you like this video, share it with friends.